happening around our country. Tonight, UTEP's Black Student Union hosted a candlelight vigil downtown at San Jacinto Plaza. A spokesman from the BSU, from BSU saying it was a chance to speak out on the senseless violence. ABC 7's Jamie Morin was there. She's live with more. Jamie. Evan and Josie, a very calm tone here at San Jacinto Plaza. Taking a look behind me, you can see a lot of people still here, kind of just reflecting over what they heard earlier today. Earlier, though, there were a lot of people singing on stage. They were also reciting poetry. Some were holding candles, others holding glow sticks like these. There was also a lot of emotion within the crowd. Before the vigil, music played. Some wrote signs that said Black Lives Matter. Others said All Lives Matter. But also, I think why uh, so many people have come by and then come say they agree with the sign because it is saying what a lot of us believe. Then more than 100 people gathered at San Jacinto Plaza. The fallen police officers in Dallas were mentioned briefly. But the majority of speakers focused on the black community, who they say were victims of senseless violence. They held up photos of victims they believe were wrongfully killed. Many also speaking out against El Paso Police Chief Greg Allen's controversial comments about the Black Lives Matter movement. All lives matter. Black lives matter to be a hate group. It is not a hate group. So therefore, all organizations, especially the black organizations, should be out here. Yeah. Despite the controversy and differing opinions, many say they were there to support everyone, no matter the race or position or power. We're here for equality and just to understand, uh, just to help the, everybody understand that, you know, we're, we're here as peaceful people. We're here to say a prayer for the victims that have been suffering throughout basically the whole month and even, at, uh, even before. So that's, that's what we're here for. Once again, a lot of people just talking amongst themselves uh, very calmly after tonight's vigil here at San Jacinto Plaza. Uh, we did see uh, some security monitoring the event, but I'm told the majority of them were actually dressed in plain clothes. Luckily, no violence stemmed from this event. We also did not see any protests. Reporting live from San Jacinto Plaza, Jamie Warren, ABC 7. Peaceful protest, Jamie. Thank you. Reporting live from San Jacinto Plaza. And as Jamie mentioned, El Paso's police chief Greg Allen's